Hey guys, and welcome to my video. So today I'm going to be doing a Lost Millennium uh, booster pack opening. Uh, I don't have a booster box of this, but I got quite a few booster packs. So I got uh, 10 here, and I have 10 here. So I got a total of 20 booster packs. Um, so we'll be opening up those 20 in this video. And I have an additional... Uh, lot here of Lost Millennium um, of a total of 50 so what I have is essentially 50 booster packs of Lost Millennium right here so yeah we're gonna open up these 20 first and uh, see what we get and we'll put off to the side those and hopefully we get some awesome pulls um, yeah, I want to see if I can get an Ancient Gear Golem, um, Brain Control. Uh, really what I want this for is uh, the Elemental Heroes. Um, I don't have any of them. Uh, I do have uh, like Chaos Neos. Um, I do have a few, but I don't have any of the original, and that's what I'd like to get. Um, so I'd like to get Avion, Burstinatrix, Clayman, and Sparkman. So even though they're commons, it would be really awesome to have them. So we'll go ahead and start. Um, I got this. <clears throat> I got this on eBay, and uh, the guy said they were unsearched. He didn't say they were unscaled. So we'll hopefully get some hollows. We'll see though. So ancient gear soldier. Nice clay man. Oh, look at that! Right off the bat, ancient gear golem. That's crazy. And uh, that's the cover card. That's awesome. Really cool. Nice. Glad I got that. That's a good start. So, I guess they weren't scaled. Um, really awesome that uh, I got them for pretty, pretty cheap. Um, I got each lot, which he was selling. Um, Ten booster packs per lot uh, for $13.00. So, Hita the Fire Charmer, that's a cool card. Des Wombat. So yeah, I got them for very cheap. Burstinatrix, that's also nice. We got Upside Down card. Grave Osha. Oja. Oha. That's our rare. Asa the Earth Charmer. Really, I'd like to see if I could get... Um, What's his name? Uh, Thunder Giant. That'd be a, one of the one of the ones I'd like. Maybe uh, I think uh, maybe it's a Rampart Blaster. I'm not sure if this one if that's in this set. Burstinatrix again. Oh, nice. We got a super rare Ultimate Insect Level Seven. So not bad. So starting off good. I'm glad that these weren't scaled because that was a very cheap price that he sold them for. So and since I bought a lot, I got it for a good deal. I mean, you can't you can't really even buy a booster box for less than about sixty-five, seventy dollars, maybe even eighty dollars at the high. So nice Avion. So all we need is a Sparkman. Ooh, that's cool. Kosaki self-destruct button. It's really dark, but in that angle, it looks cool. That's cool looking. Miss polymerization. So we're doing really good. We got three hollows so far. And I don't know how uh, this this guy got all these packs. But, uh, yeah, he must be a card shop or something. Nice, we got Elemento Hero Sparkman. That's nice. So we got the whole set. Hopefully we can get a lot more of them. Royal Surrender. And uh, the reason why I bought this is because uh, I want to collect the whole set. Um, I could have bought a completed set off of a card shop, um, Phantasm Gaming. Uh, but they don't give you... Um, ultimate rares they only give you the lowest rarity which would be uh if like something comes as ultra rare 
you're only getting ultra rare you're not getting ultimate rare that and same thing with the super rare you're not getting a super rare uh that's an ultimate so it kind of sucks and uh you're almost paying the same price for a completed set for uh a booster box and you might as well just open up a booster box and have mint cards rather than having their near mint cards or whatever they suggest is the quality I'm very picky with my cards and uh, I just don't buy uh, single cards I have and I've been disappointed too many times so nice we got a clay man legendary black belt I saw an opening and this was ultimate rare I'd like to get an ultimate rare even though uh, it's not a very good card uh, maybe it is but uh, yeah I'd like to get one just because it looks cool and ultimate rare a lot of these cards look really awesome and ultimate rare and that's like what I'm really trying to collect since you can't really get ultimate rares anymore and uh, GX is a really good set for that to get ultimates another Avion oh Carto Sanctity that's cool looking that'd be awesome if we got another one of those in ultimate rare I think um, not sure but I think uh, Grandmark is in here which is a monarch which would be cool to get so we got a burst in the tricks spell stopping statue a rare double attack White Ninja, Miss Palmization, and King of the Skull Servants. Millennium Scorpion. Alright, left side's down. These packs are so thin. When uh, I first got them, they were all, like, they had no air in them. Which, um, if my, I think my Gladiator's Assault will go up before this. Not too sure, though. Um, yeah, and uh, they were, like, full of air, so... Uh, I did scale a few of the uh, packs just to see if they had hollows in them and to see how you could, because uh, I just got a scale and uh, I'm sick and tired of buying uh, loose booster packs and uh, not getting any hollows. So it's only happened a few times, but I'd rather not have it happen. Ooh, nice. Probably uh, a, one of the best, I'd say, DD Survivor. That's really awesome. Ultimate rare. I don't know how much this goes for, but um, really awesome. Nice. It's a good one. Fine Golem. I don't know if we're going to be able to beat this first opening. <laughs> nice. First Luna Tricks. Master Monk. Come on, let go of the cards. This one's giving me difficulties. Okay. Ooh, Clayman. Ooh, an Avion. Royal Surrender. Oops. Lost Guardian. Asa. Guardian Statue. And also, um, a little sneak peek of uh, my next video. It will probably be... Cyber Dark Impact, 
and uh, I have another 50 lot coming um, so look forward to that Ooh, a mid shield gardener that's kind of cool so I'm doing exactly like what a box would be uh, it seems like um, so I got one two three four five six I got seven hollows out of almost like I want to say 16 or 15 packs or whatever doing really good ancient gear soldier oops oh another card of sanctity that's a good card I just like the picture I don't care about the effect or the what it does but I think it's cool I mean it's just iconic to have cards that were played in the anime and uh, I don't know how many times that uh, Yugi used that card it's unfortunate that they didn't print the stuff exactly how uh, the anime was but I understand from a, a game perspective it wasn't fair so or it's not that fair <laughs> so battery charger spark man ooh I, that's my first one this looks really awesome in ultimate rare a lot of these cards do but this one especially I forgot um, when she was reprinted but it seems like she's been uh, reprinted or she has like a distant cousin that's uh, in a newer set that I watched if any of you guys know let me know in the comments forgot the cards name Hita nice and Avion who a burst in the tricks token feastable All right, so we got two packs left. Let's see what we get. And then I'll be doing another opening of Lost Millennium pretty soon. Des Wombat. Another Bristinatrix. Cryo Sphinx. Grave Lure. Wind. All right, last pack. We end with an ultimate. There are no secret rares in this set, so um, the secret rares don't start until uh, Strike a Neos. So, ooh, a Sparkman, Clayman, ooh, a Kusaki self destruct button, regular rare. All right. So I'll do a recap of uh, all the elemental heroes that I got. That's pretty much all of them. The four, the main four: uh, Clayman, Sparkman, Bristinatrix, and Avion. So, if you guys are looking to get a um, a box of this, you're probably looking to get about that many of uh, elemental heroes. So that's pretty good, um, especially if you want to make an elemental hero deck out of uh, a couple cards um lost millennium's the box to start with uh, sorry for the background noise the trash man's going by conveniently um so we got <clears throat> card of sanctity we got uh, two of those let me focus real quick so card of sanctity two of those and then a master monk which looks pretty cool he's a ripped old man Reminds me of uh, uh, the guy that Jaden, he uh, battles with the um, reprinted Egyptian gods, or the Egyptian lords, or whatever. DD Survivor. That one looks awesome, an ultimate rare. I'm glad I got that. Uh, Kozaki Self-Destruct Button, uh, another ultimate. So we got two ultimates, an uh, ultimate insect level 7, and an ancient gear golem. And that was awesome to pull this first card, especially since uh, he's on the pack. So, pretty awesome. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. We'll catch you on the next one.